the system is changing. We are moving from generation of large units to generation of smaller units, like millions of solar panels or wind turbines. The generation is not located anymore close to the customers, but where space or where the energy like solar or wind is available. The customers are having completely different requirements with having solar panels on their roofs and possibly electric vehicles in their garage. And the system is becoming more and more interconnected. And right now we are not stand seeing the end of the development, but we are seeing the beginning of the development. In the past, the regimes focused on electric connection of large power plants. It did not focus on the many small units that are being connected today. And it was always in the national context or in the regional context and not giving clear rules, but only guidelines. The electricity connection rules were focused on connecting large thermal units or hydropower units. In the future, they have to adapt to connect millions of new units like solar panels or wind power. The connection rules were focused on the national requirements. They were not focused on the overall requirements of the European system. The electricity connection rules for customers were only for passive customers who just draw energy. But today they are users of electricity and they are producers of electricity, so we need a new set of rules. The new network codes provide a level playing field. The world is changing. We are seeing many new solar panels coming on, we are seeing many new wind turbines coming on, and we need new rules so that we can operate the system in a secure way and keep the lights on.